Hello everyone, welcome to Simplians YouTube channel. Today we will see how you can learn Java using ChatGPT. So learning Java with ChatGPT is like having a friendly tutor by your side to guide you through the world of coding. So from the basics to advanced concepts, ChatGPT explains everything in a way that's easy to understand. You will learn how to write code step by step, starting with simple things like variables and moving on to more complex stuff like making your programs. With ChatGPT, you will get to practice what you learn with fun exercise and examples. It's like having a conversation where you ask question and ChatGPT helps you find the answer by the end. And you will be amazed at how much you have learned and confident in your Java skills to make your exciting projects. So whether you are a beginner or a pro, ChatGPT is here to make your coding journey smoother and more fun. With its help, you can solve problems faster, learn new things and build awesome software with confidence. Craving a career upgrade? Subscribe, like and comment below. Dive into the link in the description to fast track your ambitions. Whether you're making a switch or aiming higher, Simply Learn has your back. So before we jump into the demo part, here is a quick info for you. If you want to switch careers with AI and ML, then try giving SimpliLearn's postgraduate program in AI and machine learning from Purdue University in collaboration with IBM. This course teaches in-demand skills such as machine learning, deep learning, NLP, computer vision, reinforcement learning, generative AI, prompt engineering, chat GPT, and many more. So don't forget to check out the course link from the description box and the pinned comment. So let's get started. So this is our chat GPT screen. So here first I will write, give me a monthly basis plan to learn Java from beginner to sorry to advance level okay press enter so it will give something like see on month one first getting started with Java basics in this you can love learn introduction to Java and then oops concept then in month two you will uh, learn collection frameworks then exception handling and file input output then in month three, advanced Java topics. Then in fourth month, advanced Java concept and frameworks like Java frameworks, web development with Java. Then in fifth month, advanced topics and project work like this. You can ask ChatGPT for monthly basis plan. So now what I will do here, right? So this is looking a little bit tough. So what I will do, I will write here using the above monthly plan now give me a weekly plan to learn Java okay so it will give me weekly plan from this plan okay so in week mean what I will do introduction to Java basics setup development and first you have to install JDK Java JDK okay Java development kit right into your ID then start with variables, data type, and operators, then day three, then this, then week two, then week three, then week four, like this. Then again, I will write here. Let me copy it from here, okay, and paste it here. So I will write using the above weekly plan. Now give me daily basis plan to learn Java, right? Now I have a day one like days plan daily basis plan day one day two day three day four so it is more easier to focus on right so this is your okay number of days 27 right fine so now you can follow your schedule as per this to learn java so now what i will do i will ask here explain day one concepts briefly okay so on day one, you will set up your development environment of Java programming. Here is a brief explanation. What is development environment setup? You will install the Java development kit JDK, which includes this, this, this. Then about what is JDK, then ID, integrated development environment, installing JDK. Then explain me day two briefly. 
Okay, explain spelling is wrong. Okay, on day two, Java history is there. Basic syntax. Okay, see variables here. Data set types are here. Variables are used to store data and program, and they can hold different types of values like this. Okay, and okay, first let's see here something. If you want, like, see day three, dive into control flow statements. If I'll switch. So we can directly write here, please explain me, okay, what was that, control flow statements using example, okay, so it will, first it will tell you what is control flow statement, control flow statement Java used to control the flow of execution in a program based on certain condition, right. So there are three types of control flow if else switch statement and loop statement okay see if else statement plus the example okay so there are comments also for your better understanding okay right see if else then switch then switch example okay so this is a syntax this is an example loop then again syntax this is an example loop by loop okay so see how much easy to learn Java using ChatGPT, you can ask anything and it will give you. So, let's see one more. Which one? Okay, okay, okay. So, I will write. Oops, concept. Okay, let's see classes and object. Okay, explain classes and objects in Java using example. Okay, so in Java, classes and objects, this is this, this, this is a syntax of classes and objects. So this is an example for what? My class. See, it's using classes. And what are the objects and classes you can learn from here? An object is an instance of a class. It's created based on the blueprint defined by this, 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 this. Right? So this is how you can learn any function in Java. Right? Whatever your function name is, just type it and say it to explain okay so after completing these function so we can move on to practice some basic programming question like how to find prime number of Fibonacci series like this okay so I will write here give me code to find prime number numbers in Java okay so this is your Java code to find prime numbers see this is too easy okay if you want to explain it ex you can write here explain me this code okay see it will explain you right see it's break down see here you can see let's break down the code step by step this much you can learn this is the main method of the program it first you find the variable lower bound and upper bound see this is how you can learn easily right let's see one more give me code for Fibonacci series in Java and you can learn any language from this any programming language using ChatGPT. okay so this is your Fibonacci series right and you can ask him to explain fine so now it's come to the project so I will write here based on topics we covered till now give me some project suggestions suggestions on java okay so it will suggest you some project okay so you can build simple calculator application you can build student management system you can build inventory management system so these are some basic java projects you can create and you can add into your java projects list or in github you can add or in resume you can add okay let's make to do list fine so give me code of to do list project Okay, so here is simple implementation of to-do list in Java using JavaFX for the graphical user interface, right? 
so this is how you can create any project and you can learn any project okay you can ask him to explain to you can ask chat gpt to explain this particular project okay so now what you can do you if you want to learn more about java so you can go to youtube simply learn you can search here java okay so you can learn java from here the full courses are here as you can see 1.2 million views are here okay so many of peop many people are coming into our channel and learning java from here itself right so here is a playlist you can look for the courses java courses okay from our particular youtube channel simply learn got it so with this we have come to end of this video if you like something about this video please do like our video subscribe to our youtube channel and press that bell icon to never miss any update from youtube so thank you for watching stay safe and keep learning with simply learn staying ahead in your career requires continuous learning and upskilling whether you're a student aiming to learn today's top skills or a working professional looking to advance your career we've got you covered Explore our impressive catalog of certification programs in cutting edge domains, including data science, cloud computing, cybersecurity, AI, machine learning, or digital marketing. Designed in collaboration with leading universities and top corporations, and delivered by industry experts, choose any of our programs and set yourself on the path to career success. Click the link in the description to know more. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.